Another possible road rage incident has claimed another life. Cities across North Texas are seeing an uptick in these incidents. Earlier this year, Dallas police stepped up road rage enforcement to its highest level in a decade. And this story is another reason for officers to stay vigilant. A father and husband shot and killed in his truck along I-30 in Dallas. WFAA's Malini Basu spoke to his family as they demand justice. I lost my best friend, my dad, my everything. And he, her Tato's father, left to get his truck fixed and never made it home. His family believes he may have been killed over road rage. They shot my dad, they shot my dad. Juan Manuel Hurtado was found shot in his truck just before the I-45 and the 75 split in Dallas. It happened just after 7.30 Saturday night. He was shot multiple times. A 911 caller reported there was a vehicle shooting at another vehicle. Authorities are still looking for the suspect who was driving a silver or light colored truck. Whoever was there or saw something, to please let y'all know where the cause. Hurtado was just 48 years old. They took my dad. He was a father of four, a husband of 30 years and a grandpa. <laughs> I couldn't say goodbye. His family says he was a hardworking immigrant from Mexico. He worked as a construction worker despite just having one arm. A lot of people th thought that he couldn't do anything, but I bet you he was better than anybody with two arms. Family members are begging the public for help. We want this closure. We don't want to have this open. I don't want to tell my kids your grandpa was murdered. Hurtado was the sole provider for the family. They've set up a GoFundMe account hoping it'll pay for funeral expenses. Police are asking the public to please come forward with any tips. And remember, you can remain anonymous. We're in Dallas. I'm Malini Basu.